Hello and welcome to the program, Sula's Big Adventures, with me, Sula. This episode is about the Draconid Meteor Shower. This meteor shower is produced by the debris leftover from Comet 21P, Giacobini Zinner. It was discovered in 1900 by Michelle Giacobini. It's sometimes called the Giacobinids, <laughs> but we're just going to call it the Draconids because the radiant is the constellation, Draco the Dragon. This comet takes seven years to orbit the sun. When it makes its closest approach, it can produce meteor storms. It last made its closest approach in 2018, and it did produce a storm. It'll next be closest in 2025. I'm filming this in 2024, so there won't be any storm, but it can produce about 10 per hour, so it's worth having a look at. And there's no moon interfering. The waxing crescent moon set just after sunset. And it's very clear tonight, so it's a good time to look for some meteors. So let's have a look at some meteors. I have my telescope out because I thought I'd look at Saturn and some other things. But you don't need a telescope to see meteor showers. You just need a dark sky, your naked eye a blanket or a reclining chair, and that's it. The Dracronid meteor shower is known for producing long meteors that can be visible for one or two seconds, which is very dramatic, and it won't start till around 9 p.m., which is earlier than some other meteor showers, which don't start till around 2 a.m. I got my two inch 56 millimeter eyepiece, I got my UHC filter. I was going to look at the North American Nebula, but the sky is so bright. <laughs> That's when I realized there's another Aurora Borealis, and it is spectacular. So let's have a look at the Aurora Borealis, the northern lights, right here at 45 degrees latitude in dark skies, Montana. This was an unforgettable evening of stargazing. <laughs> I only saw about 10 meteors. They were pretty nice, but 
the aurora was incredible. So that's it for now. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll see y'all soon. Until then, get outside and enjoy the night sky. Dark skies forever. Sula signing off.